Okay, so watch this. So we have this sipa. We have this sipa. Okay, so now what's gonna happen, we got a distance closed sipa, right, where I wanna end up here, right, where I, whatever, I end up close here. I wanna end up close. But for the sake of what we're doing is a transition sipa here. So what happens here is I can start off high here, but then I wanna step forward with this one here, right? So we go like this, one, and then we go heel on top of the foot here, and then this is where we are. Or you could go direct to foot, meaning you go up high here, go drop on top of the foot here, right? So similar motion. In step, facing the ceiling, this one. Similar motion, this one. Similar motion, this one here. So when you're doing this foot stomp here, heel goes first. So this is nice to partner, this is not nice to partner, step forward here, okay? But then this is kind of like, again, this is transition, meaning I don't want to think of it as a boom, here, and then I'm like, haha. No, this is where I go here, one, here. Then you could start working close because this is what you chose. You chose this to close distance, okay? So again, here, boom, boom, you go high, you could go low, right? You could do that to simulate or you could go on top and do this. Right? There's no way to flex on this one. Meaning like, you know when you throw a tie kick to the lead leg, your partner could kind of like go into it or flex their leg like to brace for it. This one, there's not much things you could do to brace for a heel on top of your foot. Okay, so be mindful of this. Don't lose your balance and fall on your partner's foot. Okay, so again, feed, feed, feed. You could even do some stop checks like this to feed it. He thinks you're going high and then Go low here, okay? Wanna see it again or you good? Good? All right, go step on each other's feet. 